let's solve the third question. So now we have two different kind of matrix. This is two by three matrix. Well, this is three by two matrix. Okay, miss, this is different matrix. Can we solve it? Yes. Apabila dia operasi, darab sahaja. Okay, apabila dia untuk operasi darab sahaja, operasi darab sahaja, yang membolehkan mereka adalah dimensi yang berbeza. Okay, this is times, but we don't usually write it down. We don't usually write it as x. Okay, we just straight away really know that they are multiply. Okay, so the thing is, how do you solve this? Is actually, you will know the answer of the, you don't really know the answer straight away. But what I meant is, you will know the dimension at least. The magic here is, you must make sure that here, when you, you know, you would letak dia sebelah sebelah lah senang kita. If you letak dia sebelah sebelah, you akan perasan macam, oh, tiga ni sama. Yes, that is the first thing that you must check. Kalau bahagian dalam ni adalah nombor yang sama, maksudnya kita boleh selesaikan. Means, means, we can multiply. Nah, itu maksud dia. We can multiply the matrix. We can multiply the matrix. Okay, ni bukan multiply macam multiply biasa ya. This is about multiplying the matrix. So, might remember, matrix ada dimensi dan dia mestilah di uh, kena tahu cara nak darabkan matrix. Tidak sama ya dengan yang biasa-biasa tu. So, just make sure, just make sure you have the same number. Allah, panjang pula. Tak, tak kisahlah. Same, same number. Okay, when you have the same number, then you can multiply the matrix. Itu je syarat dia. And at the end of the answer, at the end of the answer, when you're trying to solve it, you akan dapat dimensi yang berbentuk 2 by 2. How do you know, miss? Because, because this is the 2 by 2 that I'm talking about. Okay, just make sure dalam dia, nombor yang sama, 3 dengan 3 tu sama kan? But luar dia adalah 2 dan 2. So, 2 dan 2 ni lah yang bakal menjadi jawapan kamu. Ah, how is that works? Let me show you then if you haven't seen this before. Don't worry. I'm here to teach you. So, now, cara nak selesaikannya adalah just highlightkan ni dulu. Kamu ikut apa yang saya highlight ni. Okay. This is how we do it. Kita kena darabkan row bersama column. Darabkan row bersama column dulu. That will be your first element. Okay. You boleh dah macam dah siap-siap dah tahu akan ada empat element. Here, here, here and here. Dia memang two by two matrix. It is just that dalam element tersebut dia, dia akan ada operasi darab lah. So now I show you how we darab it all. Hati-hati eh. So, here 1 will be times by 2. Plus 2 times with negative 3. Plus 3 times with 2. Let me write it down. 1 times 2 plus 1 times 2 plus 2 times negative 3. Plus 3 times 2. So that is how it works. Alright. Let me make it small. Because I don't have enough space. Okay. Now yang belah sini pula. So now yang, say, yang, yang seterusnya adalah pula. 1, 2, 3 here. Will be times with the second column. First row times with the second column. Untuk bahagian sini pula. Ah, okay. So now. Satu darab satu tambah dua darab empat tambah tiga darab satu. 
So that is how it works. All right. So that will be the second element. The third element is negative 2 times with 2 plus 0 times with negative 3 plus 5 times with 2. Make it small a bit. Well, the last element would be negative 2 times 1 plus 0 times 4 plus 5 times 1. Let me make it small a bit here. Wow, miss, you have found the 2 by 2 matrix. Can I double check my answer? How do I double check it? I will double check it based on here. 2, negative 3, 2. 2, negative 3, 2. They must be sama tau. Well, here is 1, neg uh, 4 and 1. Here must also be 1, 4 and 1. Sebab ini adalah bahagian the second column. Yang saya highlight ni adalah bahagian second column. Alright. Well, here, the first column here, 2, negative 3 dan 2 berada di sini. Is it amazingly how you can check it? Yes, that is so amazing. So that you won't be you won't be doing careless mistakes. Alright. So now what you can do is selesaikan saja. You akan dapat 2 plus no 2 minus 6 plus 6. Okay. Well here is 1 plus 8 plus 3. Here is negative 4 plus 0 plus 10. And here is negative 2 plus 0 plus 5. Therefore, you will have 2. You will have 12. And here is negative. Sorry, here is 6. And here is 3. Is it right? There we go. That's our answer. So that is how you times matrix and here is the magic this is what this is two by two matrix that is how you must be very careful in doing multiplication untuk, ma untuk matrix so maybe we can try again on the second on the next question number four here now dia kata find a squared so a squared dekat sini jangan kamu takut a squared dekat sini is just literally multiply the same matrix. Iaitu negative 1, 2, 3 and 4. You just multiply it. They are just the same matrix. So 2 by 2 matrix. Since kebetulan. Kebetulan dalam dia memang 2. Of course luar dia pun 2. And at the end of it, you will get what? You will get 2 by 2 matrix juga. You will expecting, uh, itu ayat yang paling sesuai kot. You will be expecting to get 2 by 2 matrix. Disebabkan ini, disebabkan hujung-hujungnya um, yang akan membantu kamu dapat jawapan 2 by 2 matrix. Yang penting, as I said, yang penting di dalam ni mestilah nilai yang sama. Mestilah nombor yang sama. As long as you understand, as long as you making sure that dalam ni adalah dua, uh, digit yang sama iaitu dua. There you go. You will expecting two by two matrix di luar nombornya. Okay, you get me? So now, let's solve it. Okay, cara nak menyelesaikannya adalah hati-hati ya. Just make sure that you are imagining that you will have two by two matrix. And dalam and and here goes finding the first element adalah dengan negative one and two didarapkan dengan okay row column ini okay this is the first row first row darapkan dengan first column okay so now let's do it Bismillah negative one times negative one plus two times three. So this will be your first element. 
Okay? Second element is negative 1 times 2. Okay? Can you see? Negative 1 times 2. Okay? Negative 1 times 2. Plus with 2 times 4. Boleh nampak? Kalau yang ni pula. 3 darab negative 1 plus 4 darab 3. Kalau yang sini pula. 3 times 2 plus 4 times 4. Alright. Therefore, you will get 1 plus 6. Here is negative 3 plus 12. Here is negative 2 plus 8. Here is 6 plus 16. Therefore, the answer is 7. Here goes 6. Here goes 9. And here goes 22. Yay! And I got it right. That's how you do it. Just be careful. Da dalam memilih uh, nombor-nombor itu. Okay? Just be very careful. And then, I would like you to do uh, A times B by yourself. Okay? I would like to do, I would like you to do A plus B by yourself. Do the multiplication and check whether you got this answer. Alright.